I'm most <clears throat> interested in is the writing part because that's the I feel very confident that I can do production, I can make the film look good, it can have beautiful photography, if uh, I can find, even if I can't uh, afford big stars or actors, I can find new actors who will be good. I feel very comf comfortable about that. Where I am least confident, most insecure, is the writing, because this is what I always considered as a young person. I wanted to be a writer. I have been writing ever since I was, you know, maybe 19, 18 years old and always felt, oh, I have no talent as a writer. I wish I could have talent. And I think writing is one of those areas, acting is another, where if you're not very good at it, if you try and you work and you try and you write and you write and you write or you act and you act, you can actually get better. The way I write is it's like I have a great big ball of dough, pasta, and I'm writing and, you know, once in a while I take some and I make a pizza or I make a cake or something. So, but it's all, it's all the pasta of my life, all the ideas I have, something... I saw, or a dream, or an observation, or and, and the important thing is that it doesn't have to be a whole developed idea, it just has to be like a seed, and then when I'm ready, I will just um, work on it every day, maybe in the morning, because the morning is a time when you're very rested, and then after I have maybe, you know, whatever it is, 60, 70 pages, uh, then I'll read it. Then what I like to do now is I like to take it and write it as a short story. Okay. And the reason I like to write it as a short story because I look at it from another way. In a short story, you're able to say things that you can't say in a screen. And uh, very often, I will just... Um, one thing I've learned is maybe just write the ending. Because the ending is uh, obviously very important and it's where everything has to go and uh, otherwise if you don't just write the ending then you're going to be saying oh i don't have an ending very often i leave it as a short story and i even show it to my colleagues as a short story and then we go and we look we talk about the actors or we go look for locations or whatever but we only have the short story and we find locations and sometimes the locations are very unusual and you say, wow, we could just really use that, and you note that down. Notes are important. And then um, when, when we're starting to get closer, then it's time to write the screenplay. And so in the screenplay, I can incorporate some things about the actors we've thought about or the locations. At any rate, now is the first time that I translate it all into a, a screenplay. So that's more or less my process now. Okay.